It is hot. Hey everybody, John here. Welcome back to Catbird Hill. So I know I begin every video by saying how hot it is. And it is hot. <laughs> uh, we are... Oh, gosh. Dog days of summer, huh? Right at the very end of August here. And today is another... 90 degree day and the humidity when I checked it a little while ago the humidity was about 75 percent so it is very uncomfortable so I have not been doing any kind of chainsawing or tree cutting or firewood production it's just been so hot um, and I just don't like running chainsaws for a long time in this kind of heat. Plus, I'm just, it's just very uncomfortable to do that, as you well know. The other thing that's super hot here on Catbird Hill are firewood sales. And I have no idea why. Well, I think I might. But uh, we continually keep restocking the roadside stand here. Um, despite this heat, which has been going on for about three weeks now, we've been selling, we've been selling out almost every week. Um, the stand can hold probably 12 bundles. Um, I usually put nine, six or nine in there. We'll stack a few more in later, but we've been selling out pretty much every week. And I think what's happening is people are getting in the mood for fire pits for the fall. Um, it's starting to look a little bit like fall around here. We've got some leaves dropping from the trees, primarily because it's been so hot and dry. Um, you know, some of the leaves are starting to turn just a little bit yellow, probably maybe a few weeks earlier than they normally would. But anyhow, um, I think people are just getting in the mood for fall. And I don't blame them. <laughs> it is truly my absolute favorite time of the year just because I love the fall weather. I love working outside when it's kind of crisp in the mornings and you might need like a long sleeve shirt or a hooded sweatshirt or something and then it warms up during the midday. But despite this heat, I think people are just itching to get out and uh, do things in the evening. And a lot of that has to do with the fun of, of having a fire pit. So most of the customers that I've run into who are buying wood from us buy maybe two to four bundles at a time. And I think, and, and the bulk of them are telling me it's fire pit burning. Um, I've had a couple of big orders over the summer. Actually one from my next door neighbor, he bought probably almost a full cord of wood, just loose. Um, he just came, to the back of our property line where I have a lot of the wood stored and we just loaded up his truck and he took it away. He's just planning for the fall. He's actually planning. They, they do big family get togethers just about every weekend in the fall, all through winter. They've got a huge fire pit. Um, you know, they get together for college football and pro football on the weekends. And so he's just stocking up. He wants to make sure he doesn't run out. So anyhow, just a little bit of an update here. Uh, not a lot of heavy work going on on Catbird Hill. The heat has kind of gotten to us a little bit. And uh, as soon as we get a nice break in the weather, I've got so many trees to deal with. I've got about four or five trees to take down pretty close to the house that have been needing to come down for a while. So uh, all of them except one yeah, all of them except one are hardwood trees and are going to be great wood for, for um, firewood sales. But anyhow, that's it. Just a short video, an update. I hope you guys are all doing well. I hope you're not melting where you are. Um, and I hope to, um, uh, to continue to see more of your names and your comments below. Tell me what you're doing right now at the end of the summer. Are you looking forward to the fall? Any big projects you guys have coming up? Let me know what's going on in your lives on your properties. Please uh, give us a thumbs up. It helps move the channel along. We're inching our way up toward that 500 subscriber mark. And as you recall from a few videos ago, after we hit that mark, we're going to have a big giveaway. Uh, we're going to give away the Husqvarna chainsaw chaps. 
um, that are really nice. So that would be a great gift for somebody. So please share the, share the videos with your friends, encourage them to subscribe, give us the thumbs up, click the bell icon to get the notifications. And until next time, I'm John here from Catbird Hill, just sweating away. Take care.